Hi and welcome back to another video of Medic Notes. This video is on Balatable Kidney. For introduction, this is a sign we feel for during examination of the abdomen. In normal kidneys, they will not be balatable. With the patient lying supine, one hand is placed over the flank, and the other on the anterior aspect of the costophrenic angle. The hand underneath ballots the kidney upwards. The kidney is balatable if felt by the upper hand during this maneuver. The conditions that are associated with this physical finding is polycystic kidney disease, which is the most common. Other less common conditions that can cause balatable kidneys are renal cell carcinoma, Wilms tumor, amyloidosis, lymphoma, and uretic obstruction, causing hydronephrosis. For its mechanism, an enlarged kidney, from whatever cause, such as tumor, amyloid infiltration or aberrant cystic expansio, is closer in proximity to the anterior abdominal wall and is more likely to be palpable when pushed upwards, hence balatable in those conditions. A very favorite question by examiners during exam, is the causes of unilateral versus bilateral balatable kidneys. Unilateral causes, include polycystic kidney disease, which it can be either asymmetrical, or following unilateral nephrectomy surgery, where one kidney has been removed. Renal cell carcinoma, hydronephrosis, hypertrophy of solitary kidney, renal vein thrombosis, or you are actually feeling the liver, whereas bilateral causes include polycystic kidney disease, bilateral renal cell carcinoma, bilateral hydronephrosis, infiltrative disease including hematological malignancy, acromegaly, or you are feeling the liver and spleen. That's all for this video. Thank you.